prairie pothole is uh, is a pond, a wetland. Farmers call them sloughs. A lot of people wonder when we talk about potholes, they figure we're working on roads. And hey, that's not our thing at Delta. We're actually trying to uh, protect these potholes uh, through our Adopt a Pothole program. And you too can be a part of that and help adopt a pothole. The prairie potholes attract ducks there. Uh, they provide pear ponds so that ducks will settle in those areas. Uh, many ducks actually nest right in the potholes. So in this uh, cattail that I'm standing right in front of us here, that provides uh, nesting cover for mallards and the diving ducks. So for canvasback, redhead, ruddy ducks, ringneck ducks, all this vegetation in the pothole itself is what ducks use to nest. Um, and then for all the ducks, mallards often and teal nest in the uplands. So they're up in the grass, but, but then they bring their broods to water. And that's the thing is that these prairie potholes are the second most productive, aside from rainforests, the second most productive ecosystem in the world. And so you can see I'm standing in a bunch of different types of vegetation here. It's providing food, it's pro providing protection with cover for those ducklings. So the, the females come here, bring their broods here, and raise their broods here. And so in a wet year, the broods will be swimming with their hands throughout this flooded stuff and are very protected from the predators and they provide uh, a lot of food for those ducklings to grow into adults. So, so prairie potholes are, are incredibly productive ecosystems and critical for duck production in North America. Delta started its Adopt a Pothole program back in 1991 and with that we were working with the North American plan and hunters as supporting adopting potholes like these and we did 10 year leases and that was started in 91 and ran its course till uh, about 1999 when we got for the first time ever we got legislation passed to do as the Americans had been doing for over 50 years and that is wetland easements and so we've switched from that now to a new partnership um, through the, again through the North American plan but with many other partners like states like Illinois and uh, Louisiana and the, it's part of the North American plan which includes the Canadian federal and provincial governments here um, and the main delivery agent is the Manitoba Habitat Heritage Corporation and MHHC is actually the agency that that signs easements and uh, holds easements and they do all the enforcement and regulations uh, in perpetuity so Delta stays out of that long-term commitment provides the upfront funding uh, to do the adopt a pothole still and protect those wetlands forever but MHHC is the ones who actually look out for the easement over the the long term. Since we started our wetland easement project with the MHHC we've uh, we've signed up 500 wetland easements to date and it's the largest program of its kind in all of Canada. And so we're super excited about that. Uh, we were the first ones to sign up an easement back in 99 and we've got the largest program going. And that's not where it ends. With your help, we're gonna continue to grow this program. We're gonna continue working with groups like MHHC and others across Canada to get wetland easements going all across the country and greatly expand that so we can get to the same place where in North Dakota, for example, there's up to 70% of the wetlands are protected in many counties. The Adopt a Pothole program provides you with a unique opportunity to protect prairie potholes that are so critical to the future of duck production in North America. Uh, we would really encourage you, as, as I have, given to Adopt a Pothole, and you can really leave a legacy for you and your grandchildren by protecting these wetlands forever. So please donate to Adopt a Pothole. Thank you.